Welcome to this BI Quick Tip. For more background on the BI tool, please visit our Help Files website. In this video, we will take a look at how to use Power BI to better visualize data. Let's begin. Starting at the Power BI desktop, we'll click on Get Data. From here, we'll select Excel and browse to the Excel file that we want to import. We'll select the file and click Open. Next, we'll select Table 1 by clicking the check mark right by it. We can view a preview of our document to the right, but if everything looks good, we'll click on Load to continue. Now, we can begin to select everything under the Fields header for our table to show. We will then click on the Clustered Columns chart and select everything under the Fields header for our chart to fill in. We could drag the chart in order to shrink or enlarge it. Once we are done editing our visuals, we could publish our work to Power BI Online by clicking on File, Publish, then Publish to Power BI. We will click Yes to save our changes to the file rename it, and click Save when we are done. We will highlight My Workspace and click Select on the bottom to finish up. Clicking on the link will open the file in Power BI Online for us to continue editing the file if needed. In the My Help Desk portal, we will use the search bar here to type in Power BI, then hit Enter. Then, we will click on Knowledge Base to see helpful articles related to our search keywords. Now, we can click on How to Create a Report using Power BI Desktop. Here, we will find a great KB article that will explain a little more in depth of the quick tip we covered. Thank you for watching this episode of the BI Quick Tips series. You can find all BI Quick Tip videos on the Help Files website. Until next time.